Hello and Merry Christmas everybody. I'm meteorologist Dan Giroux with your weather on demand for UpperMichiganSource.com. Well, it was a pretty cool uh, Christmas day here. We only made it up to a high of 15 degrees, which is well below average for this time of year. Nowhere close to our records on the day. They were both pretty extreme. And uh, some of the snow totals that we saw over the past day, the heaviest was in the east in Newberry at 8.5 inches. Uh, Ontonagon also saw a decent amount of snow. That was just throughout the day today. They saw Saw about 7.5 inches of snow and that will continue overnight and we'll show you that here we do have a lake effect snow advisory until 7 p.m. tomorrow for Keweenaw, Northern Houghton as well as uh, Elger and Luce counties until again tomorrow at 7 p.m. Ontonagon also has a lake effect snow advisory until 8 a.m. tomorrow morning and all of those areas could see about four to eight inches of snow in a lot of those areas so be careful if you have to travel outside or uh, give yourself some extra time out on the roads as well. So uh, right now on satellite and radar, we're not looking at too much snow developing right now. It'll happen a little bit later overnight. It is snowing here in the western portions of the Upper Peninsula if it is uh, only light in nature, but uh, it's not being picked up on the radar at this time. Otherwise, just mostly cloudy and we have to zoom out to see some of the closest snow here in the Great Lakes and that's where most of the snow is across the United States. It's pretty clear. In fact, we have to head up to the northwest before we find our next disturbance, and that will be passing through our area by the weekend and could warm us up quite drastically. Uh, the coldest of the air is just to our north, and it's barely dipping into the United States right now, but it's still cool here. 7 degrees in Sawyer, 14 in Minneapolis, a little bit warmer further west and further south, but uh, some of that air will be coming our way for the weekend. So here's that low pressure system perched over us right Right now and we'll be passing through the Upper Peninsula overnight. We will see those winds change out of the west and that's where we'll start to see those uh, lake effect snow showers develop. And then by tomorrow uh, we do see this pass further to our east and we will see some lake effect snow showers across the Upper Peninsula associated with that. And then back off to the west is where we do see our low pressure system that will move in for the weekend. Friday looks to be quiet. We could see some mostly cloudy skies and then by the time we get to Saturday, warm front pressure passes through the Upper Peninsula and we could see temperatures close to 30 degrees in some areas, so it could be pretty warm as we get into the weekend. Uh, now for tonight, we'll see our temperatures in the single digits snow in the north along those lake effect snow belts uh, where we will see those westerly winds come off of the lake and see those winds at about 5 to 10 miles, 5 to 15 miles per hour and uh, some mostly cloudy skies in the south with a slight chance of a snow shower for tomorrow. Temperatures get into the low to mid teens with some snow showers in the north well, associated with that lake effect and then mostly cloudy skies in the south with some winds out of the west at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. In your TV six day forecast, we warm up for the weekend, but then as we get closer to New Year's, it's going to be a bit more a bit frigid and so expect our temperatures to be cold as we start our new year. Merry Christmas, everybody.